What is anxiety and how to deal with it? Do you always feel like it is too difficult to get through your day? Have you had sudden feelings of nervousness, panic, insomnia, and fear, as well as sweating and rapid heartbeat? If yes, then maybe you have anxiety. Here are the common symptoms of anxiety disorder. 1. Intense nervousness. 2. Helplessness. 3. A sense of impending panic or danger. 4. Hyperventilation. 5. Obsessive thinking and increased heart rate. And 6. Sweating and trembling. Anxiety can interfere with daily activities and be difficult to control. They are usually out of proportion to the actual problem and can cause you to avoid certain places or situations. Some people with anxiety disorders need psychotherapy or medications to get anxiety under control. But for others, lifestyle changes and coping strategies make a difference. So, if you think you have anxiety, here are some tips for you to easily cope with your anxiety disorder. Number 1. Be physically active. Develop a routine so that you become physically active most days of the week. Exercise is a powerful stress reducer. It can improve your mood and help you stay healthy. Start out slowly and gradually increase the amount and intensity of your activities. Number 2. Use stress management and relaxation techniques. Visualization techniques, meditation, and yoga are examples of relaxation techniques that can ease anxiety. Number 3. Make sleep a priority. Do what you can to make sure you're getting enough sleep to feel rested. If you are sleeping well, you can be able to think better and easily help yourself deal with your anxiety. Number 4. Eat healthy foods. A healthy diet that incorporates vegetables, fruits, whole grains, and fish may be linked to reduce anxiety. Number 5. Learn about your anxiety and its triggers. Talk to a healthcare provider to find out what might be causing your specific condition and what treatments might be best for you. Try to figure what situations or actions cause your stress or increase your anxiety. Practice the strategies you develop with your mental health provider so you're ready to deal with anxious feelings when it comes. You may also involve your family and friends by asking for their support to help you understand your condition better. Number 6. Keep a journal. Keeping track of your personal life can help you and your mental health provider identify what's causing you stress and what seems to help you feel better. Lastly, socialize. Don't let worries isolate you from your loved ones or activities, but be sure to only connect with people who are good for your mental health. I hope this video could help you somehow. Remember, be kind to yourself, always.